Hi, boys and girls. Today, you are going to listen to the story, Santa's sleigh is on its way to Rhode Island, a Christmas adventure. I hope that you enjoy it. All right. Santa's sleigh is on its way to Rhode Island. Let's see, where's the author? Written by Eric James, illustrated by Robert Dunn. It was so small, I almost didn't see it. The Moon Over Providence. Let's see if you recognize some of the names in this book, some of the names of towns or cities. You might recognize them. The Moon Over Providence cast a cool glow. Rhode Island lies snug under blankets of snow. The star-sprinkled sky is especially bright. Hey, Santa, hey, Santa, please visit tonight. The snowmen in Cranston stand perfectly still, their hats and their scarves keeping out the night chill. The icicle sparkle as the snowflakes drift down from Gloucester to Jamestown and all around. So these are towns in Rhode Island. So you live in Lincoln, but some of these are other towns in Rhode Island, such as Cranston, Gloucester, Jamestown, and Providence is the capital. I used to live in Gloucester, so I have a connection to that. I grew up there. The Christmas trees twinkle, the eggnog smells sweet. The stockings are out for the gifts, not your feet. The garland and paper chains hang from the ceiling and give the whole household that Christmassy feeling. Have you decorated for the holidays yet, boys and girls? We sure have. There's my tree right there. There's another shot of it for you. And we have Christmas lights outside and we're actually gonna go get some hot chocolate and drive around and look at Christmas lights tonight. So maybe that's something that you can do with your family. It doesn't really cost anything and you can just ride around neighborhoods that are really close to you. And it's something that we like to do, especially around this time of year when there's not too much going on, um, but that's something that you could maybe do as a family. Excited young children with heads full of wishes leave large Christmas cookies and carrots on dishes. Ooh, carrots for the reindeer, I love that. Cookies for Santa. They scurry upstairs, for they've heard it is said that Santa comes once you're asleep in your bed. So they're going to, they're going to bed? Why don't you go to sleep? In Warren, which is another town in Rhode Island, the yawns become stronger and stronger. The children of Warwick can't stay up much longer. From Newport to Bristol and Woonsocket too, they're soon sleeping soundly, all children but you. You stand at your window and gaze at the sky with hopes that you'll see Santa's sleigh whizzing by. You almost nod off, but see movement ahead. A flurry of white and some flashes of red. You jump up and down as the shape becomes clear. Hey Santa, hey Santa, my home's over here. But something is wrong. These are sparkles everywhere. The sleigh twists and turns as it swoops through the air. Goes Santa's sleigh. It's moving pretty fast now. You're wide awake now. You've had such a fight, a fright. There's no chance of sleep till you know he's all right. You think about Santa, his reindeer and sleigh. Hey, Santa, hey, Santa, I hope you're okay. There he is. He's kind of all upside down. Oh, dear. He's buried in the snow. I think he's going to be fine, though. Just needs to fix his hat. Yes, Santa is fine. He's at Goddard Park. Huh? Guess what? Goddard Park is right down the street from me. I live right near Goddard Park. Replacing the fuse for his sleigh in the dark, he tugs on the reins, shouting, up, up, and away, and hits the ignition, which starts up his sleigh. There he is. He's at Goddard Park. With magical speed only Santa possesses, he visits well over a thousand addresses. From Smithfield to Tiverton, handing out, handing out toys, he visits each house without making a noise. It's amazing how he does that. He's so, so quiet and so quick. Now Santa has been to all houses but one. He can't go back home till this last house is done. It's your house, of course, but you're still wide awake. He circles above as he takes a small break. And that's when you see him. You know he's all right. Your head hits the pillow and you're out like a light.
He lands on the roof to the sound of your snores. It's Santa, it's Santa, he's coming indoors. <gasps> but oh, you wake up and you jump to your feet. You're sure you forgot to leave Santa a treat. Will Santa leave presents for someone so rude? You must go downstairs and make sure he has food. So worried that he didn't leave him any cookies. Oh no. You enter the kitchen and turn on the light. He's hiding behind the door. Not spotting the figure who ducks out of sight. You're still half asleep, so you don't find it's weird that the broom has a hat and a coat and a beard. <laughs> and then I love this right over here. The, the dish towel says, I love Rhode Island. That's where you all live. You live in Rhode Island. That's a state you live in. You get out the cookies, still rubbing your eyes, too blurry to make out his clever disguise. You open the fridge door, and you don't spot the broom as it sweeps past you into the family room. There he goes, a sack full of presents. With a plate in your hands, you head off to the tree. You're feeling so sleepy you don't even see a sight that would have your heart skipping a beat. The curtains have sprouted. He's hiding. He's hiding by the curtains. Two Santa-sized feet. But he's so asleep, he doesn't even see it. Still sleepy, you head back to bed with a smile. The panic is over. It's all been worthwhile. You climb up the staircase, not once looking back, as a chuckling Santa takes toys from his sack. Ho, 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 he says. Putting out all the presents. Now Santa is leaving. His sleigh races high. It sparkles and fizzles and lights up the sky. The Barrington street lights grow dim in the night. Hey Santa, hey Santa, please have a safe flight. Soon Santa leaves charming Rhode Island behind, where children are lovely and grown ups are kind. And then he booms loudly, his voice full of cheer. Ho, 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 Rhode Island, I'll see you next year. Bye, Rhode Island, he says. I hope that you enjoyed that story, and I hope that you recognize some of the towns in this book. They're all the towns in Rhode Island. What town do you live in? That's right, you live in Lincoln, Rhode Island. Lincoln is the town, Rhode Island is the state. And I hope that you enjoyed this story, and I will see you next time.